Is Bowman U Chrome Football the best value product that you can buy? We're going to find that out in today's video. I have two blasters right here. And as you can see, there is a lot and a lot of stuff that you can hit. Um, that's one of the things that I love about this product is that you can hit one of one super fractors. Basically everything from hobby you can hit from the blasters. It's just a lower hit rate. So um, that makes it super fun to open, super high ceiling, stuff like that. Um, so let's go ahead. Let's hop into these blasters. Um, you can find these for as cheap as $15. Um, you just gotta look in the right places, but you know a lot of the times they're $20 plus. But let's go ahead, let's get into these. You're gonna have seven packs as well. That's something um, that you know Panini doesn't do. You have a lot of packs in this product, makes it a lot more fun. Um, but the unfortunate thing about these boxes is the cards are slightly warped um at least most of them are some of them are worse than others but tops didn't do a good job on the quality control on these cards so you are going to have a lot of base cards and you know pink refractors that are going to be warped but the numbered cards the auto stuff like that that's not warped so um you know your super high dollar cards those are not going to be warped or anything like that you know i mean there's still the chance of them being messed up a little but um you know that i mean that's the same thing with panini a lot of panini's cards um are not in the best shape but let's mix these up and hopefully we can have some big hits every single player in this set has autographs um, you got CJ Stroud, Autos, Bryce Young, Anthony Richardson, and a lot of other players, Jameer Gibbs, Bijan, Dontavion Wicks. Um, I'm missing anybody. Caleb Williams, that's his first Bowman year in here. Um, Tank Dell is also in this product as well. So tons and tons of players. That's why this product is so appealing because um, you can hit autographs of all those top guys in, in here that you know their autos aren't in Panini products. So there's our first pink refractor. You're going to have, it says four cards per pack, but when you have a pink refractor or something like that, they just add that card to it. So there was five cards in that pack right there. So let's go ahead, hop into this pack over here to the right. And we've had some pretty good luck um, with these blasters lately. We've hit a Caleb Williams auto, bro, a gold no Caleb bro, Williams no way. first oh one. Um, those goodness. were on stream, so they were not personally for us. But um, something that we did hit personal was a Jordan Addison gold first Bowman. That was a pretty big hit. We got Nolan Smith on the pink. So usually there's maybe like a numbered card per box. That's usually how it goes, but you know it's not guaranteed. So we got Bijan on the front, and here's like kind of the warp that I was talking about on the cards. Dontavion Wicks, Cade Klubnik, and a Sam Hartman. But again, you know, the super high dollar cards that you're going to hit aren't going to be warped. So that's the good thing about this product. And hopefully we can hit an autograph in today's video. And let's keep going. So... We have our pink behind here. See, there's Tank Dell. Um, he used the name Nathaniel for those. And we got Dallas Turner on the pink. So um, nothing super, super crazy so far. But still, this is, you know, one of my favorite rips to do. It's just, you know, pretty relatively cheap. Makes sense. And you can hit some good stuff. So let's see what we have here. We have a refractor of Ben Urasek and then Treshawn Potts. So again, nothing, nothing crazy yet. We're almost to halfway, not quite yet. Um, so there are seven packs per box, so makes it a fun long rip. That's what I love about this product. We have another refractor here. It's going to be Andrell Anthony there, uh, Brennan Armstrong, and Logan Diggs. So we haven't seen any big names yet. Still uh, searching for that Anthony Richardson, CJ Stroud, even just base cards. Um, what do we have here? I think this is a retro. There we go. Jalen Carter on the retro. That's a nice looking card. 
Tony Grimes, and Sam Hartman. I wonder if there's going to be a retro in this one. We will find out. But we are officially halfway through the um, boxes. And what do we have here? There we go. We have a retro. There's Mason Smith. Come on. Ooh, can that be Caleb Williams? It's either Caleb Williams or Jordan Addison. Okay, so we're going to have Jordan Addison. Um, unfortunately, not Caleb Williams, but still. That's a really sick card. And let's keep going. So we have, we've hit the same exact stuff out of um, each box. We have two pinks, one refractor, and one retro. We got Israel Abanaconda. There's Nick Singleton on the Ramblin' Man, so this is just an insert. And then Ronnie Bell. And let's see if we get a uh, Ramblin' Man from this one over here. I even mixed up both boxes. So. Let's see. Yeah, we have a Ramblin' Man. And you can hit numbered Ramblin' Mans out of here. So we got Zach Evans. There's Jaron Hall. And Ty Simpson. Coming down to the last two packs in each box. Still no numbered cards. I mean, like I said, there's usually a numbered card per box. So um, if we're going to hit one, it should be coming up. So we do have a pink refractor here. We got Rakeem Jarrett. There's JSN. Forgot to mention him, but he is in this product and he has autos just like everyone else. And that guy right there. All right. So we have three packs to go. And I want to see something nice. We got Treshawn Holden on the front, Spencer Sanders. We got Treshawn Potts. There's Xavier Hutchinson and Will Shipley. All right, these last two packs really need to have something good in here. I mean, we obviously haven't really done too great on these openings. I mean, you never know with this stuff. And I don't think I see numbered. Nope. So nothing numbered from this box over here. Xavier Hutchinson, Jaron Hall, and a Treshawn Potts pink. So um, this is a recap of the box on the left. Um, honestly, nothing super, super good. I'd say the best card, probably that Jalen Carter, maybe some of the QBs um, later on would be pretty good. Um, but here we go. Last pack on this side. Let's see if we can get lucky. Really need to see something in here. And I do not think we have anything numbered. Nope. There we go. Anthony Richardson. That's probably the best hit um, of the whole entire video, which is not saying a whole, whole lot. And Phil Jer uh, Jerkovic. So... Anthony Richardson, first Bowman, is the best hit um, of this whole entire video. So, unfortunately, um, we did kind of get smoked on these. But still, a really fun rip. You can hit really big in these. I love these because the ceiling is so high. You can hit everything from hobby, like I was saying. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments what you think about these boxes. I'll see you in the next one.